leader of Los Angeles, Mayor Eric Garcetti. Let's give him a big hand. Thank you, Chris. Good morning. Good morning. You ready to build this city? Yeah. You ready to build this building? Yeah. You ready to make LA great again? Yeah. Because think about it. Five years ago, we had building trades, men and women, living in their cars, losing their homes, feeling the pinch of the greatest recession in our lives. But we didn't get just knocked down. We talked about how we were going to get back up the tallest building west of the Mississippi. Something that we could look at and tell our children and our children's children and hopefully their children that we had a hand in building. But one thing I want to say is this was built by union labor, wasn't it? This was built by people who are represented by great unions who could stand up for working men and women so that when you have an honest day of work, you can get an honest day of wages that supports your family and your community, and you spend those dollars in your neighborhoods, and those can get recycled over and over again. That means a good middle class job for each one of you. And I say, if you want to get a job done right, you do it union. If you want to get a job done perfectly, you do it union. 2,664,472 work hours. That's jobs, that's prosperity, and most important, Look up and see this building. It's soaring to the heavens just like we're going to be doing in the city of LA. Excellent, we're just so proud to have you here. And we're gonna go up in the building and take a look at some of the work. And what are the other three buildings about that? Uh, then there's uh, the Mayor to the Union men and women uh, built this, wow. and it's the finest craftsmanship you can get. I mean, from the iron workers and the plumbers, from the cement layers, from folks that are doing things that they have learned, not just for years, but some of these men and women for decades. Uh, you can't build the tallest building west of the Mississippi with folks who don't know their craft. And that's why it's so important, not just to have a union to make sure people get paid well and compensated fairly, but also to make sure that this is passed on generation to generation to generation. So that these men and women can look back and say, I did that. It is a strong building, it's a strong city, a strong middle class, and we get that done.